part two. Shame. He was revealed. And the things that I had been wondering about and, and asking him about, she has revealed it all. And I found out where my distractions was. I found out who was coming against me just by her going in the room of the Holy Spirit. And I'm so grateful and I'm honored and I'm humbled that she has gone there. And I have not been in a church. Uh, it's, been, it's been almost a year now. Um, because I can't find anyone that can, you know, relate to where I'm going. And it is always, uh, you know, jealousy or envy or strife or discord. And then they always try to blame me for everything, you see. And, and when she went into that, in that realm, I said, oh my God, this is it. This is it right here. I said, this was going on because I, I, I was beginning to wonder if that is it me or what is what is what is really the problem, you know? Because it's like everywhere I went, it was always a blame game or it was always, you know, them throwing things at me, as they say, throwing stones from the pulpit. You know what I mean? You're like yeah. hurling stones at you and like insults from the pulpit. And I'm like, I know this is not Jesus. Jesus wouldn't do that. Mm -hmm. He just gives you the word, or if he want to rebuke you about something, he will do that. But that's not how it went. Amen. And so I was like, I'm, I'm just not going to go nowhere until God tells me to go. Amen. And um, my spiritual mother said, no, you need to be under someone you can trust. And I said, well, the one that I do trust, he's not here. He's in another state. <laughs> So, I thank God, for, I just thank God for the anointing of her life. I thank God for her life, amen. And I just thank Him, you know, for leading me, you know, when I went on YouTube. And, and my spirit, my spirit was automatically in agreement. Um, I was like, oh my God, this this is like my sister. You know what I mean? You know, when you when your spirit connects with somebody, just like Jesus with John the Baptist, that's just how it went. It's like, oh my God. Oh my God. And some of our tongues was the same. I said, Jesus, I said, this is my my oh my God. This is this is this is her. This is her. This new God wants me to, you know, I say be under you know, just for guidance. You know what I mean? There's someone that's powerful in the spirit realm that can relate to what I'm going through. Amen. And when she went in about the, the, the witchcraft on my father's side, that was so true because I was the one who had to take on that curse. Amen. And God told me, he said, you got to lead them out of it now. And I'm like, oh, my God. So I, I'm just I'm just humble. It started I'm, with the humble. thing that started it all off with the what the Holy Ghost called out was the word yeah. fearful. Right. It's the dream. Yes. You were experiencing dream. dreams. Yes. That were and strange. The Holy Ghost said very strange dreams like someone wants to kill you or like push you off a cliff. Yes. yes. And that is so true. Because I was seeing some of the people that I saw and this was just recently. Matter of fact, it was one just this morning. And I'm like, I thought this was my friend, you know. And this was the person I had prayed for. I prayed for him and his wife. And I was like, Oh my God. Jesus and I, I, you, you just never know. <laughs> and you were seeing also, the Holy Ghost showed you were seeing like shadows in the sides of your eyes. And you said, yes. Or mm -hmm. something. Yes. Yes. And like at, like my, my vision would go blurry all of a sudden. I'm like, what is this? And I would put on my reader's glasses and I could see. But it's not supposed to be like that. And she tapped in that. <laughs> she tapped in that part of the detail. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, and all the detail I, and specifics with the land. 
with the yes. man, the unfair game. Yes. That yes. Was played. Because in 2014, there was some land um, that was left for the family, and it went to the children. So we would wonder why my stepsister's name was on the land. And we was like, she's not even a child of my father. She was just, you know, a stepchild. And um, they said, no, her name shouldn't be on there. And so they were saying that the land, there was um, a, a pipe, a pipeline under there. And they needed to get in the pipe. And I said, well, if there's a pipeline there, there may be some oil, you know. And so they said, no, it's now they said the land is worthless. And they said, they need your signature. And I was so hesitant about it. And I was like, they said, and they kept pressuring me. For signing, I said, okay, I'm, I'm just going to sign They said it's worthless, so I'm not going to worry about it. No one forget it. I just signed it, and um, I sent it back to them. And I, I haven't heard anything else about it. You know, I just felt like it was worthless. And they said, well, they did have, like, if I would, if I would die, that they have a free plot for me in South Carolina. Jesus <laughs> God Almighty. Mm-hmm. That's what they told. Well, the Holy Ghost was revealing that um, that was to be yours, but mm -hmm. somebody took it behind your back mm -hmm. to take mm -hmm. it for themselves, the Holy Ghost said, because they see you as soft and want to take mm -hmm. advantage of you. However, mm -hmm. uh, the, the Holy Ghost, the, through the woman of God, prayed that the power of fire, blood of Jesus, has to scatter and shatter all those forces of darkness. Because the Lord showed they wanted to blind you at night. Mm. That was at night you said you couldn't see. They even wanted to cripple you. Take mm -hmm. over spirits. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Wow. Bless God. Bless God. But the warning that the Holy Ghost said, which I thought was very, very key, is that you are, um, your, it causes you to be fearful, but you're trying to pray, but you can't because you're nervous. The Holy Ghost said no psychic, no palm reader, nothing, nothing, nothing that will come and put your hand in anything dirty. That was just Amen. the Holy Ghost speaking right there, which I thought was so powerful. Because God is saying, because the next thing that came forth was the calling that was on your life. The problem yes. is calling. Yes. And that was revealed to me in 2006 by the same guy she was talking about. <laughs> Hmm. Yes, that is so true. Um, Holy Ghost. <laughs> Holy yes. Ghost. Yes. Also, the Holy Ghost showed there were, um, you know, struggling, like, with finances. Yes. Well. Definitely. Yes, in God. The business I'm in, it'll go so far, and then it's like it cuts off. And I'm like, what is going on? And when she revealed, I said, oh, my God, that's the problem right there. Right. That is the problem. It, it said in, yes, it said in the workplace, in the workplace, mm -hmm. the Holy Ghost spoke those words. Mighty mm -hmm. God, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Jesus, we give God praise. And I know yes. you were receiving, prophetess. I know you were receiving. Yes. As, as the Holy yes. Ghost was breaking scattering, shattering, mashing, everything you are receiving. And it, mm -hmm. uh, and it is a blessing to have you in the midst. Look at this date. And as I said to Sister Anne Marie, look at this date. You know, we, we pray every day for that YouTube channel. We speak to that YouTube channel that the Lord would draw people, draw people to the channel. Yes. And I have to tell you, there are thousands and thousands of people posting things on there. It's just, yes. it's just overflowing. And, and think about it in the natural. The odds of you or someone else landing on Apostle Sharon Hamilton's channel is, you know, what are the odds? Pretty high, right? That the person would land on it, but not with the Holy Ghost. 
the Holy Ghost drew you in at the appointed time on this day of new birth. And I bless God, too, the thing that she touched on speaking of birth was what the Lord was showing when you were um, in the womb with your mother's belly. Yes. Yes. And, and that is so true, woman of God, because my mom said she had such a hard birth. Uh, with me, she felt like she was gonna die, and she said that I was cross, crossways, you know, like green. Yeah, they had to, yeah, yes, and, she, and they had to turn me around. Yeah, yeah. And the Holy Ghost showed her that. Showed it. She said, "Can mm-hmm. I? Can I go back?" She said, "May I go back?" And you said, "Go ahead." And and yes. the Lord took her all the way back. Look at that. The Lord 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 Lord. Took the woman of God all the way back. The prophetess mm-hmm. Michelle's time when she was in her mother's womb, in her mother's belly, and could yes. see and and actually hear the conversation of your mother having as she was putting her hand on that belly, and I believe yes. the Holy Ghost said she was even checking to make sure that the baby yes. was still moving. Mm-hmm. That is true. I did, my mom told me, she told me about that part. Yeah. Oh my God, <laughs> Jesus! Can we give the Holy Ghost glory? Can we Hey, Jesus. Hallelujah. I have it all over me. I, I'm telling you right now, I feel from the bottom of my feet through shooting through the top of my head. I could feel it for you, my sister. Mighty God. I love you, Holy Ghost. Oh, mighty God, I love you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for what you did for us, sister. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God, there's such a joy, there's such a joy that comes when people are free, when people are set free in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, when people are healed, when people are delivered, when people are saved, it's such a joy, mighty God, mighty King Jesus. Oh, God, I love you, Jesus. Sorry, my sister, I just couldn't contain myself. Jesus, I love you. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, God, for that baby that was in that womb and that the, and that the Holy Ghost, you know, tapped in. And, and let me tell you something, the, the calling the Holy Ghost was saying on your life. And that the enemy wanted to try to stop it, but no way. No way, because the Holy Ghost told the woman of God, the angel, the angel was there with your mother. The angel was there during that time with that pregnancy to bring forth that baby, healthy and beautiful. The enemy tried, wanted to do whatever he could do, but the gates of hell did not prevail. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, glory be to God, hallelujah. Lord. My God, my God. Lord. Is there anything else, my sister, that you want to share? If not, that's fine. I just wanted to give you the opportunity to make sure if there was anything else. Jesus. Thank you, God. Let's give God praise. Let's all give him the glory. Let's give him the honor. Let's magnify him. Let's worship him. Jesus, you alone are worthy, God. You alone are holy. Mighty God, the joy, the joy, the joy that we feel. Your children are delivered, healed, and set free, mighty God. God, we give you that praise. We give you that honor. For there is nobody like you, Jesus. Nobody can compare unto you, Jesus. Holy One of Israel. What a mighty God you are. What a mighty God we serve, Jesus. Jesus, angels bow before you. Heaven and earth adore you. Praise be to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Go forth in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory. Jesus, mighty God, hallelujah, Jesus, 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 Jesus. Glory be to God, hallelujah. Marco Setri Kandor Boshende. Rabba Baba 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 Bekendel Boshende. Thank you, Savior. Don't forget, my God, on my. Hold on, people of God. Don't forget. Don't forget, my. Jesus. 
Glory be to God, hallelujah. Don't forget, my God Almighty, prophetess Michelle, that you are to do that seven day fasting, my God Almighty. Marco says we can't do the there. Mama Mashandai. Yes, thank you, Holy Ghost. The gates of hell shall not prevail in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Marco says we can't do the motion there. Thank you, Jesus. Rabba Basende. Hallelujah. What a day in you, Jesus. New birth. New birth, Jesus. A birth in you, mighty King Jesus. Holy God. Holy God. Marco said to the Rabia Kandar Basende. Marco, God Almighty, living in New York City, but you are thinking of moving from out of New York City. But you are, you are waving, you are waving and wondering if you are to do it, yes or no. Where is that person? Marco, I would really like to move from, from where I am living. Are you in New York City? Yeah, I'm New York. Yeah, I live in the Bronx. Marco said to the country, that's what I'm talking about, mommy. You're, you're thinking of moving from out of New York City, are you? I was thinking to go and live out in Brooklyn. No, no, no. I said out of New York City. Out of New York City. Anyway, what's your name? What's your name? My name is Nicola. Marco said to the candle the bush in there. I saw, I see in the room you're thinking of my God Almighty moving from that place to you said you want to move from the Bronx to but I, I anyway anyway you take it, it's all about moving because the Lord is right and as I tap in my God Almighty in the room I know I get somebody in there in New York City want to move Marco said to the candle the bush in there. Mama Shende, Roko Satarakatiya Mama Kunda. But there is also my God Almighty. You want to move, but you are fearful at the same time because you're saying you don't know really where in Brooklyn to go and live, and you want to make sure that you know as you move along, all is well. Come on, talk to me. Yes. Yeah. Marco said to the candle the bush in there. And it's on I also, my God Almighty, hallelujah. See in the realm of the spirit, my God Almighty, where Rabba Kotoria Bashende. You are also where the Bronx is concerned. It's not I don't know who invite you there or what have you, but um it has been a difficult toss. Yes. It has been a very difficult toss in the Bronx. Where you find things, you know, being difficult, things not able to rise the way you want it to rise. Yes. Marco said to the Kandorobo Shende. And it's not just this year you wanted to move. I see in the room three years ago you wanted to move, but you, you're not, you, you, you just don't make up your mind to do it. Come on, talk to me. Three years ago. Yes, because my husband leaves me. Me, me. Mommy, I don't ask you no question. Please don't tell me your business. Don't do it. Okay. Don't do it, Mommy. Okay. Did I know you to know that you want to move? Don't, don't do that, mommy. Your husband leave you because of witchcraft. Not just witchcraft, but family members also in truth in your, in your, in your own life. Yes. Family members in truth. That's the word, my teacher. Intrude. 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 See, I hear the word called, you know, when I'm speaking. I want you all to know that I'm not educated, but the Lord God Almighty said he will use me as a foolish thing to confound the wise. So when I'm, you know, call word and so forth, I have my teacher there, Minister Gay, glory be to Robasha Marco Setrikandorbushende. 
to correct me when I don't call the word properly. And I'm not ashamed, you know. I'm not ashamed. I'm just, I'm just being blessed to work for God in such a condition with my education. I wonder if you all understand me. Amen. Great and mighty things for the Lord Jesus Christ. That don't mean that don't mean that I will eat my name and bulla now, people. If I see my name and bulla, I would make sure I rub it off and eat the bulla. Get <laughs> just, just a joke right there that we used to say. And they used to say, "Oh, that child is so dunce that if she see her name and bulla, she don't know she just eat her name." But I'm um, I'm 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 not I'm not as bad as that. The Lord give me, you know, helping me in wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. So you all have to understand it. I'm not afraid or ashamed to speak about this because I am blessed to be working for God. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Glory to your name. Amen. I wanted to go back to school. God said, mm -mm, I want to use you just as all you is. Amen. Hallelujah. And this is Bible, people. He said he will use the foolish things to confound the wise. The wise. Hello. Marco says we can't do the bush in there. Let me get back my God Almighty to Mother Nicole right now. Marco says we can't do the bush in there. The reason why you want to move my God Almighty is because of your husband gone, leave you and your dear and <clears throat> You don't really have my God Almighty family. You don't really have friends and all those people around you to support you, to be there for you. Name it and what of you. Because in the midst of your husband, it was like my God Almighty, your husband was the in thing for everyone to run into to get what they can get. Come on, talk to me. Okay. Yes. Marco set Ricando the Boshende, Raka Satarebe Kende, Rabababa Konde. And I also, my God Almighty, see in the midst of you, I see some little touchiness. Touchy, 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 touchy. Come on, talk to me. Yes. I see some touchy touchy where you fussy yourself about this, you fussy yourself about that, you fussy yourself. Roba Kotoria Bakandari and Darbashende. Ribia Baba Bakundai, Mama Masheke. Ribia! Marco set to Rikandaya Mama Kundai. Marco set to that's power people, power, power, power. Ribi Mama Kotoria Bakendi and Daraba set to Rikatara Bakundai. Mama Mashende Robo Kotoria Basandai. My God, mighty Jesus, I feel the power of God. Marco set to Rikandar Boshende. Raba Kundi and Daraba Sende. Raba Kotoria Bashende. Hallelujah. But you also, my God Almighty, have to be careful of where you're moving to and name it and what of you, you know, because Rabba Kotoria Basende, you, you have to look at the many years, the many years of what you earn and what you work hard for and name it and what of you. Come on, talk to me. Yeah. Yeah. Marco said to the candle the Boshende, you know what you really need? You need Jesus more than ever. You need to get closer into Jesus Christ. You need to, because your focus is so much on your situation, name it and what have you. Get what I'm saying to you? Yeah, yeah. These are things that um, your situation um, started to occur from 2012. Come on, talk to me. Yeah. From 2012, your situation started to occur. It happened, my God Almighty, 2012, May 19, May 19, the 19th of May, 2012. See if you can tap yeah. into that day, that Roma Kotoria Bashanda, when your husband, my God Almighty, come in, my God Almighty, and decided to get away with you. Come and talk to me. Yeah. Marco set to the candle of Oshende, Rikata Rabba Kundai, Rabba Baba 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 Kotoria Baba 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 Kende, Robo Kotoria Bashata, Ruku Sete Rekeke. I see in the midst, my God Almighty. I see you have a friend, my God Almighty, and you and this friend do too much talking. Too much talking. You need to pray. You all need prayer. Come on, talk to me. Too much talking. Amen. Okay. Come on, if the Holy Ghost is talking to your mommy, talk because you see God is yeah. God yeah. dig God the Holy yeah. Ghost dig and yeah. he whenever he dig he fix things. I want you to understand that. Yeah. Yeah. When you hear something when you hear something, mommy, that you that that the Holy Ghost shows, say yes, I agree. Yeah. Yes, I agree with that. Yes, I agree with that. 
Marco said to the candle about Shende. And you know, I, I see you all talking the same old story over and over and over and over and you know, come on. The, the enemy will even want you to yes. talk against your husband and all that. You don't need to because you know what happened. What you have to understand, you know, what goes around, come around. And, you know, the, the thing about it is that, you know, yes. if you, my God Almighty, can just speak good. The word of God said, well, you know, in, in, in Matthew 5, verse 44, what it said, you know, pray for those that despitefully use you. Say all manner of evil against you. Name it and what have you. Because, you know, when you do these things, then, you know, my God Almighty, the light will shine in your life and i see my god almighty we are not much praying not much this your, your spiritual life gone right down right down come on talk to me yes marco said to the candle about shende gone right down because every day is the same thing over and over and you know what i can tell you your friend is very negative i wonder if you hear what i'm saying to you your friend is very negative that's a very negative friend you have right there that, you know, will poison your mind against people and cause you to have, uh, you, there is a lump on the inside of your stomach, my God Almighty, where every now and then you would feel like something leap, it's like a fear leap inside of you, talk to me, talk to me. Yeah. You know what causes that? You know what causes that? There's a short enough unforgiveness that you need to burp out, you need to spit out, you need to throw up, you need to Book it out. Come on, talk to me. Yeah. Yeah. And forgiveness yeah. and more than one side because on your husband's side I even see he have a nephew there that my God Almighty has done wrong and you you know so much people you have up in your heart. Come on, talk to me. Yes, it's true. Marco said to the candle Raba baba 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 keke rebe ketoria basata. Robo kondi andara bashia nanana koto. I see my God Almighty a problem over some car thing, some car. Problem over car problem, pro car problem. Come on, talk to me, talk to me. I don't know about no car. I don't have no car. I Mama Kendi, no I see car problem, my God Almighty, in your family. Could be in your relative. But I see car problem. Marco said to the candle the bush in the rubber coat all the Just leave it on the shelf. You might hear it down the line. You might hear it. Marco said to the candle. Robo Kotoria Bashanda. Marco said to the Katama. Robo Kotoria Baba Seke, the Katara Mama Seke. Rababa Kotoria Baba Konderi Kandara Basanda Mama Kondai Oh God Almighty Mako Setri Katawa Wakeke Mama Sende you don't sleep good at night you don't sleep good at night Yes it's true you don't sleep good at night you go to bed late you wake up early your body is tired and frustrated come on talk to me Yes and if you don't and if if you don't be careful i see in the rim on your left side where some tingling going on on your left side like my god almighty if you don't be careful it's strokes come on talk to me yeah, come, come. Yeah. on your left side your left side there is some tingling going on like some something want to grab you up come on talk to me want to grab in the side yeah. Marco said to the candle motion. I see strokes. I see strokes looking to come. And I also see in your head, my God Almighty, like, my God Almighty, your brains is going like a highway that, my God Almighty, a freeway highway that traffic is so much on that highway, but it, my God Almighty, it is like jammed up in your brains, in your head. Come on, talk to me. Like a traffic jam. Yes. Like, yes. A traffic jam. like a traffic, traffic yes. jam. I see that going on in your head. Sometimes you feel a pain pinch you. Come on, talk to me. Yes, yes. Be careful, my God Almighty, of blood. What you call this thing, my God Almighty? Blood clot. Blood, blood clot. clot. Be careful of blood clot. Be, care be careful of, my God Almighty, even strokes. Strokes that want to shoot up in your head. Be careful because yes. I see all these things going on with you because the, the situation with you and your husband has been taken up so much, my God. And knowing that, my God Almighty, there is not much people on your side. Come on, talk to me. Yes. Marco said to the candle of Shendi, Katara Bakundai, Raba Baba Baba Baba. I see you try to talk to somebody, and it's like the person, whenever you call, the person don't want to answer you. The person don't want to have much to do with you. Talk to me. 
Yeah. Marco said to the candle of machine, they're coming from like your husband family side. Come on, talk to me. No, no, I don't talk to none. Marco said. I don't know that one. I don't talk to my husband family side. That was not just now. Marco said to the candle of machine, but I also see where you have another friend. My God, you have somebody yeah. that you're trying to talk to and the person don't want to do much with you because what the person is saying, the person is saying that the person is tired of your situation, tired of what you want to call to talk about, tired of what they want to hear. The person the person even said, my God Almighty, they, you know, they just can't bother to take up your situation because they have their problem as well. But at the same time, the person is not praying for you. Okay. Marco okay. said to the candle the bush in there. Baba Kotoria Basanda, Mama Makende. Who is Darius? Marco said to the candle the bush in there. <coughs> I don't know that, no Darius. Mama Kendi, the candle was sending somebody in the midst named Darius. You don't know that Darius, Marco said to the candle. Rabba Baba 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 Kotoria Basende, Rikata Rabba Koto. Mama send the Holy Spirit of God, my God Almighty. Marco said to the candle. You are, my God Almighty, the situation is getting so piercing right now that, my God Almighty, Mama Shekiri Kataraba Kunde Das, it is taking a toll of you. It is taking a toll of you. Yes. It is yeah. taking a toll of you, my God Almighty. Yeah. On you, yes. I yeah. see it is taking a toll on you, and I also see, my God Almighty, where, my God Almighty, I see cramping in your stomach. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Marco said, yeah. is somebody in the midst of you that talking? No, nobody is talking with me. Okay, Marco yeah, said to the candle about Shende. Mama Shanda, Marco said to the candle about Shende. Jesus. Rabba, Baba, Baba, Rocco said to the candle about Shende. Robo Kondi and Basandai, Holy Spirit of God, Hallelujah. Yes, Mama Shekuri Kataraba Kende. Robo Kondi and Basondo, Roko Sata, Mama Shende. Sometimes I see you sitting up, my God Almighty. Before you go to bed, I see you like sitting up for long. Yes, yes. Marco said to the candle about Shende. Rabba Kotoria Basandai. But you see, my God Almighty, what I also see with you, Mommy, you, you needed to, you needed to, I'm going to pray for you, but you also needed to ask the Lord to take away a lot of things out of your spirit. I wonder if you understand what I'm saying to you. Yes, yes, yes. Because yeah. I see, you know, we would call it miserableness, I see touchiness, I see complain, murmuring, grumbling. I wonder if you hear what I'm saying to you. Yes. And these things happen even in the midst of your marriage. I wonder if you hear what I'm saying to you. Yes. Marco said to the candle of Shende, Marco Sata And what I see, my God Almighty, there's a generational curse occurred from your family like from your father's side come down where it's chigger it's like it is a thing that chigger off where in the midst of marriage there's always problem because there's always disagreement i wonder if you hear what i'm saying Come on, don't get sad, mommy. Don't get sad. God want to... I don't know, I don't know how much about my father's side. I don't know much about... Okay, that. all right. You leave that on the shelf. You don't know much about your father's side. Marco said to the candle of The Holy Ghost knows. Holy Marco Ghost. said to the candle of Shende. Marco said to the candle of Shende. Marco said to the candle of Shende. Mama said I hear the Holy Ghost said, My God Almighty, you know... In the midst of your husband, before he left, there was some very warning that he was saying to you. He was saying something, but you, you probably didn't believe that things like this would occur. Name it or what have you, and you wasn't taking heed to pray. Are you there? Yeah, yeah. 
Marco said to the don't get angry, mommy, don't get angry. No, no, no. No, I'm not angry. No, I'm not. I'm Marco not. said to the candy, don't, don't, and don't, what, not, I shouldn't even use angry. Don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. No. Because God want to fix you. You understand what I'm saying? You want to fix, he want yeah. to fix you. I just hear some name calling. Who is Beatrice? I don't know no Beatrice. God Almighty, Jesus of mercy. Holy Ghost never wrong yet when he call name. It's just that you all don't know his name. My God Almighty. Rabba Kotori Abashende, Rikatsata Rabba Konda. Rabba Kondi Andalbosende. My God Almighty. Marco said to the candle of There were there were some my God Almighty some dispute. Is that the word teacher? Dispute dispute dispute. dispute. Yeah, dispute. There was some dispute between you and your husband and you the way the way it was handled, it wasn't handled pleasing in the sight of God, you know, like some carrying on and some behavior take place. All oh, the craziness yeah. is that somebody in the background, Jesus. Whoever has their phone on in the background and you're talking, please put it on mute if you're not going to worship and participate in Jesus' name. Marco said to the candle of Shende. As I said, there was some dispute. 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 Dispute yes. in the family and. These things that occurred, my God Almighty, um, you, it didn't angle properly, it did not angle properly. It wasn't handled properly. It wasn't handled properly. And because of that, you know, it get out of control. Mm. Yes. Marco said to the candle the bush in there. Rabba Kotoria Basanda, Mama Kundai. But I also see my God Almighty in the midst of your family. I see some hypocrisy thing going on. What the craziness is that? It's really loud in the background. Jesus. I'm going to mute people out. Don't worry. Yes, because the Holy Ghost is moving. Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. God Almighty. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. People don't want to worship, but people want to bring disturbance on the line. Jesus, God, God Almighty, Jesus, you are worthy, God, you are worthy, Jesus. Jesus, yes, Lord. Marco said to the candle of Shende, Rabba Baba Basanda, but you know, Mommy, I, you, you, you really need some prayer because the things them that I see going on with you right now, you know, you have to pray. You just have to be so careful that you don't, my God Almighty, get so get that sick and you know, mm. name it and what of you because so much things is going on on the inside of you. Yes. Marco yes. said to the candle yes. about Shende. Jesus. Sickness, my God Almighty. The, you, you have to just be careful because I pray, I pray long life and good health for you. But there are stuff that you, there are stuff that you have to my God Almighty. You see, I just give out long life and good health and everybody mouth shut. Thanks, thank God for those that receive it. Yes, God. Marco said to the candle of Shende, Marco said to the candle of Baba Kunda. Rabba Kotori Abasende, Mama Sheke Ye Beso Tori Abasa. And I see, I see in the midst of you, you know, Mommy, I see a lot of fear. I see, I see a lot of fear also, too, you know. Yes, yeah, it's true. I see a lot of fear in the midst of you, too, you know. Marco yeah. said to the Kandai, Mama Sheke. 
Mama Shonde Katarabakunda. And what you need, you need to you need to ask the good Lord to help you to cut down and they eat they, they, you know, a lot of talking that is not profitable. Yes. You need to ask the Lord to help you to cut down on that talking, talking, because it is a blockage. The Spirit of God is not able to be in the midst. Name it and what of you. And you know, you, 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 you really don't need that. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Marco said to the candle about Shende. Because you know, I tell you something, you know. Sorry. Your husband loves you. I can tell you that. Amen. I wonder if, are you there to hear me? Yes. yes. Your husband loves you. But it's just my God Almighty, the plan of the enemy with some behavior where you are concerned. Not that he's perfect. He's not perfect. No one. No one. He's not perfect, but and and, 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 and but the thing about it is that my God Almighty, you follow up things a lot. Yes. And because you follow up the, these things a lot, you never know that, my God Almighty, things would be the way it is with you and him. So you have to get yourself in a place where you have to ask the Lord to change you. Change me, O oh Lord. Amen. Fix me, Lord. Fix me, Lord. Because, you know, the Bible said, in Proverbs, the Bible said it is better for a man to be in the top of the house top than to be in the house with a miserable woman. Yeah. I wonder if you understand what I'm saying. And and, and the Holy Ghost yeah. is not blaming like, the Holy Ghost is not putting you down, but the Holy Ghost wants to fix things because these yeah. are down fault for you where your marriage and that is concerned. You get what I'm saying to you? Yeah. And you're, you're, you know, you're, you're really and truly need need that need for the spirit of the lord god almighty to take over so that you can be changed you know change from these things that are are blockage in your way you get what i'm saying to you yes 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 because you're, you are a good person you are a very good person but it's just that my god almighty i see these things chasing from you know generation to generation i want to hear what i'm saying yeah, yeah. Marco said to the candle about Sende. My God Almighty, you get you, you know, these things she got down from your mommy, you know. You know that. Grandmother, mommy, you, whoever, talk to me. Yeah, yes, yes. Marco said to the candle, it's, it's a thing about you all, where you all. You all believe you have the right to talk and to say and to name it and to what of you. But you know, the, the word of God said in Ephesians 6 from 22 said, you know, wife, be sub submitted to your husband. Husband, love your wife as Christ loved the church. Name it and what of you. But you know, um... The thing about it, my God Almighty, with many women that leave their country and come into America, when yes, you know, they find you have a career, you know, work in the hospital, um, being whatever career you get, you take up, whatever you do, and you know, you start to make your own money, da 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 da. You know, you have some women on some some men as well but you know women it's it's so sad when it when it is like that with women especially when you're married to know that when you get yourself in a position you just feel like you can do as you like say as you like and you don't believe somebody must tell you things because you are grown but you have to understand that marriage are ministry and you know both of you must able to communicate with each other in love in unity and in the spirit of god But I see, I see you, you used to be the stronger one than your husband where God is concerned. Talk to me. Yes, yes. And yes. your spirit, your, your, your life should have get him more stronger in you. You understand me? Yes. And get him, and get him more up in God. But the enemy step in, you know what I'm saying? Yes, yes. The enemy yeah. step in. Yeah.
God Almighty wanted to fix things for you, but you need to hear these things because if we don't see our fault and see our behavior and name it and what of you, we will just continue and believe all is well. And if God should show up, we left right back and go away straight to hell. Come on, talk to me. Yeah, yeah. So we have to, my God Almighty, you know, look into ourself and see the things that we do, name it and what have you. You know what I'm saying? Because I see your husband more as a, I, I see him as a layback person, hard working person, name it and what have you. And so I see him as a layback yeah. person. I see him as a layback person. I see him as a more, he talks, but he's more quiet in some things. He's not quick to talk like you. Come on, talk to me. Yes, yes. He's not quick to talk like you, so, you know, um, yeah. that's how I see him as, you know, very nice, very handy. I see him as a very handy person, would fix this, do this, yeah. do that. Yeah. You know, I, I see him as, you know, uh, and I also see him as a kind person as well. Yeah. Are you not sure about that one I hear, yeah? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Marco said yeah. to the candle bush in there. Yes, I see him as a very kind person too because in the midst of everything, you know, he he is he's thinking about you. I want to tell you that. Okay. He think he thought about you and all that, but it's just that when you were getting the warning you never thought things was going to happen. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, it's true. You was you never thought things things was going to happen, but it's not too late for a show of rain and God can turn things around for you. Amen. God can turn things around for you, but what you need to fix you. You need to fix you. You know what I'm saying? And he need God. He need God. He need God. He need God, you know, and all that. He need God and all that. But you know, you just it's just that you needed to um you needed to try and get yourself right where God is concerned so that, you know, yeah. things can be different and better. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying to you? Yeah. And um, um, the Holy Ghost is so concerned about your health because the thing that the enemy want to eat you with, I'm telling you, and, 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 and you're worried so much that the worried that you're worried, my God Almighty, want to bring all these sickness to you. And I see where, I see where you um, eat, eat things that you're not supposed to be eating the way you are eating it. You know what I'm saying? Yes. You have to, you have to be very concerned about your health. Yeah. Eating and drinking, you have to be concerned about your health. Yeah, that's true. And let me say something to you. It goes to everyone. When things happen to you in life, don't be quick to turn your back on God because God has nothing to do with situation. True. That is so true. Speak Holy true. Spirit. That is so Amen. true. Amen. God is the one that we are to run to. That's right. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Instead of, instead of, Amen. you know, your husband gone and name it and whatever, and instead of running to God, you're letting the enemy want to pull you away from God. I feel the Holy Ghost. Marco said to the candle bush and the yonder bush and die. We the Holy Spirit. Speak Holy Ghost. Yes. It is God that we need to run to, not to run to somebody to Amen. talk and to this and to that Amen. and name it and whatever. It is God who, you know what I love? I minister to, to a woman in England three weeks ago about husband and wife situation. And she said, all I do she said, you know, when I was there talking, I could see and I, when I was saying things to her and everything, she said, she don't, she said she makes sure she don't talk up with nobody. This woman don't talk up with people. Who is that? Somebody's blowing very heavy in the phone. Just back off a little from it, please. Yeah. Oh, she said, she said, I don't talk up with, with, she said, she said, people see me and they know that my husband is not around and da, 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 da. But I don't tell people my business. I don't talk up with people. I don't this, I don't that. Because, you know, I just want God to help me. 
And that's what the Holy Ghost was ministering to her. It's, it's, uh, it's there on YouTube. It's out there on YouTube. Yeah. Marco said to the candle about Shedney. I think it was 11th. It, it is, it is the left, the, um, the 4th of the 11th, 2017. Just the other day. The 4th of the, not the 4th. Um, no. The 8th, 8, 11, 17. That's the message. 8, 11, 17. If you all listen to it. My God Almighty. And she have, she have the problem, and you know, where somebody come in and snatch her husband and all that. But, mommy, I'm going to pray for you because, you know, I, I really need for you to change your, you know, attitude, behavior, everything, name it and what have you, and repent. You need to repent to God. You need to cry out to God. You need to, you know, ask God for forgiveness and... What is that? It's going on. Jesus. Jesus. <clears throat> what is going on in the background? Mighty God. Oh, Lord Jesus. And I'm telling you, anybody carry on and do these things to disturb the line. When I mute them out, they won't be able to come. When I call out stuff, they're not going to be able to call to, 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 um, they're not going to be able to hear me when I mute you all out. Whoever make noise on this line. Because everything going on YouTube, people of God. Everything going just as how it is. No, no editing. No editing. Going just as how it is. So you all will hear your behavior. Whoever behave rude, bad, and the line will hear their self behaving. And just don't look at it as, okay, it's nothing. Look at it between you and God. And tell yourself, oh God, I did not respect the Spirit of God. That's right. Let me pray. I'm going to pray for your mommy because I really... And I see, also see you, see in your head. I'm looking in your, in your head and I'm seeing like sometimes you forget. You know, that is taking a toll on you a lot. Memory, memory loss. Yeah, yeah. Memory loss is taking a toll on you. Like it's like that part one to shut in, and sometimes it takes you two seconds before t you can really get your set, you get your head together. Yeah. Marco said to the candle bo shende. Raba kotoria basanda raba kundi under bo si na 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 kunda. My God Almighty. Marco said to the candle bo shende. Marco said to the candle of Ashanda. Have mercy, Jesus. Mighty King Jesus. Blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, Lord. Jesus. Praise your name, Jesus. Praise you, worship you, God. Honor you, Jesus. Father, we thank you, we bless you, God, we praise and we glorify you. I lay, Lord God Almighty, Mama Nicole, before you right now, Jesus Christ. Father, you have seen, Lord Nicola, and you have seen, Lord God Almighty, the wickedness of the enemy. You have seen, Lord God Almighty, all these years because of my God Almighty generational curse from mother, from grandparents coming down, my God Almighty, on her mother's side. She, Lord God Almighty, have grown up in the midst where she see parents, my God Almighty, acting, doing this, doing robocotoria bashanda. So, Lord God Almighty, it has been, it has fallen upon the midst. Father, she have gotten, my God Almighty, a very good husband. Lord Jesus Christ, I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that you, Lord God Almighty, will find him wherever he is. Speak to his spirit, oh God. Because Lord God Almighty, he love his wife and my God. He wanted, my God Almighty, the relationship, my God Almighty, to go forth. But because, Lord God Almighty, of what happened, my God, the many things that keep repeating itself in the midst. Oh God Almighty, I come against every forces, every darkness. I come against every spirit. I ask you, Lord God Almighty, to rise up. I ask you, Lord God Almighty, to take over, move in your might and in your power. Help your daughter, Lord God Almighty, to have a new start, a new change in her life as we enter in the month of my God Almighty September number nine. I pray, Lord God Almighty, that new birth will 
will release in her spirit. Help her, Lord God Almighty, to flush out everything. Completion. My God Almighty, as we are still in 2017, let completion, my God Almighty, be upon your daughter. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, let God arise and the enemy scatter. Mighty, powerful Father, the great I priest, the great I am, the wonderful God. I ask, Lord God Almighty, right now, for the power of God, the healing power from an eye, to touch your daughter, my God Almighty, touch her in her head. I come against blood clot. I come against, my God Almighty, strokes in the head. I come against strokes in her side. I come against, my God Almighty, Kondalbo Shanda. I blood pressure. I come against my God Almighty Shandai. Every sickness I call in the angel My God Almighty Ezekiah My God Almighty angel Ezekiah Go in and touch my God Almighty God's daughter Go in Marco Setrikanda Your mama kende Mama 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 kende Go in and take over her body completely My God Almighty For I, I call for my God Almighty For the angel my God Almighty That touch my God Almighty Hallelujah, Isaiah. When Isaiah, my God Almighty, was to do, go forth, and my God Almighty, you, Lord God Almighty, asked the question and said, My God Almighty, who should I send? Isaiah said, Send me, but I'm a man of unclean lips. My God Almighty, that my God Almighty in Isaiah 6, Lord God Almighty, where the angel, my God Almighty, go in and touch him, my God. Robert! Where the angel go in and touch his lips and cleanse him. Touch your daughter this moment, my God Almighty, from every talking. Touch her, Lord God Almighty, from everything that the enemy, my God Almighty, bring in the midst. I bind up that miserable spirit. I come against complaining spirit. I come against my God Almighty, Kondal Boshanda, murmuring spirit. I come against my God Almighty, hallelujah, spirit of pride. I bind you, I cramp you, I paralyze you. I shatter you, I command you to get out of God's child in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Take her over Marco Setricandal Boshende. Rise up Lord Jesus Christ. Let not the enemy prevail but let the spirit of the true living God arise and the enemy Lord God Almighty of her soul scatter. Lord God Almighty as she Lord God Almighty look to move I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ that you will direct her God. Lead her in the path of righteousness for your name's sake. Let her not do anything unless you God Almighty be in the midst to do great and mighty things. I pray Lord God Almighty, hallelujah, that the Holy Ghost, my God Almighty, will visit her husband. Set him right my God Almighty. In the midst, Lord Jesus Christ, take over his mind, body, heart and soul. Let not the enemy prevail but let the Spirit of God arise and the enemy, Lord Jesus Christ, hallelujah, of his soul scatter, my God Almighty. Give him my God Almighty a heart to serve serve you. Give him, Lord God Almighty, a mind to do what is right in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Have your divine way, O God. For there is nothing too hard for you to do. Take over your daughter, O God Almighty. Keep her under the shadow of the Almighty. I come against my God Almighty, everything, my God Almighty, and forgiveness. Everything, Lord God Almighty, from him, from her, Lord Jesus Christ. Take charge. Have your divine way, O God. Let not the enemy prevail, but let the Spirit of God arise and the enemy scatter. As you, Lord God Almighty, is the Father, Holy Ghost, Angel of the Living God, go in and take over your daughter, God. Take her over, Lord Jesus Christ. Anoint her, Lord God Almighty. I call in my God Almighty, hallelujah. Angel, my God Almighty, Aaron, that was anointed from the head all the way down to his skirt for that same oil to drip up on your daughter and take her over in the name of Jesus Christ as we give it the praise, the glory and the honor in the mighty precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ be thou glorified I am lifted up Father God as your daughter receive my God Almighty to be changed as she receive newness this day my God Almighty the first of September my God Almighty hallelujah 17 let the power of God go in and bring my God Almighty newness new birth I birth out my God Almighty hallelujah newness in her life I command newness to be birth really Mama, Mama, Kende, so that she can able to give birth in Jesus name for newness and for good things in the name of Jesus Christ have a divine way oh God let not the enemy prevail but let the spirit of God arise and the enemy scatter in the mighty precious name of Jesus Christ 
For you, Lord God Almighty, is worthy of all your praise and all your glory. Be thou glorified, be thou I am lifted up. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I command everything that is not of God to be moved and go back to the pit of hell. In the name of Jesus Christ, have your divine way, O oh God. Let not the enemy prevail, but let the Spirit of God arise and the enemy scatter. In Jesus' holy and precious name. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Receive your healing. Receive your miracle from the Lord Jesus Christ. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God, hallelujah. Minister Gay, dear. Yes, bless God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Mother Nicola, glory be to God. We we'll welcome you in the midst. I think this was your first time joining us, right? No, I joined you all. Yeah. No, I come in. Yes, I joined you all more than once. Oh, okay. But this is the first time I've, I've spoken with you. Bless God. Yeah. So, um, what I, I don't know if you were able to hear what was going on earlier when, uh, you know, the others came forth after they were ministered to, but what we do at this time is it's a time of testimony. It's a time to, you know, give thanks and, and to speak about what the Holy Ghost revealed through the woman of God. So if you can kind of touch upon some of those areas... And, and the important thing is to just stick with exactly what the Holy Ghost spoke on. You know, don't go into other business or other details because as the Lord uses the woman of God in this ministry, you never know when she will tap in again and she does not like to know people's business. So if you can speak specifically, you know, to what the Holy Ghost talked about this morning, go forth and have an opportunity to share what God did for you this morning. Jesus. And what about pertaining to, um, you know, your situation, um, you know, pertaining to your health, if you could talk, maybe, you know, pick on a few of the things that the Lord dealt with, yes, that would be helpful. I wish it was on my head like real. Just like so fast, you know that just something like shock in my head and on in my stomach. I feel like sometimes it's feeling like tight, and like mm -hmm. on my heart, it feel like a pain. So sometimes I just try like to release, you know, like calm myself down. And did you hear when the Holy Ghost was saying? I thought this was so amazing of the Holy Ghost. Apostle could see in the realm of the spirit that your brain 
was like it was like on a highway, and she could see like traffic jam, and with yeah. all that was going on in your brain, and the Holy Ghost said your body was tired and frustrated because you're not sleeping well yeah. at night. Yeah. Is that correct? Yeah, every year at night. I will keep up. I will, uh, you know, like talk. Yeah. I, I might get a little four hours sleep, three hours sleep, I jump up. The longest I sleep at night is three hours. Sometimes like a one broken hour sleep. Like, yeah, mm -hmm. one hour is like if I sleep the whole night too. Yeah, when right. I you don't get a full, you yeah. don't get a full even seven hours, not even seven hours. Yeah. Forget eight hours, but you're just getting, you know, very limited, and then you get up again. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Really and the other thing I thought, the Holy Ghost was very important. The Holy Ghost kind of started by tapping in, saying, be careful where you are moving to. And the Holy Ghost was warning and saying, too much talking with a friend, need to pray more. Does that witness to your spirit? Yes. 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 Yes, it's true. Yes. To speak, oh. Glory be to God. And another key thing, and I think this is tied to the whole health situation, was um, the Holy Ghost... Picked you need up to speak up, God. Mommy. When you're speaking, yes. sorry yes. about that, Minister Gay. When you speak up, Mommy, yeah, no please problem. speak up. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Was the, the key area was talking about unforgiveness and, and, and people that you have in your heart. Did that yeah. also witness to your yeah. spirit? Yes, yeah. yeah, it's true. Yes, it's true. Mighty God. And I believe that the, that the Holy Ghost revealed that there was a generational curse um, through the Father's side. And even if, and, and let me say this to you, Mother Nicole, and this goes for anybody, when, you know, when the Holy Ghost is moving and, and ministering through the woman of God, if something like that is revealed, believe me, she's a root digger, and she's digging something out, out of, out of your life. So we bless God for the Holy Ghost, because it was showing that there was some type of dispute that had gone on, um, between you and your husband yeah. that perhaps might have gotten out of control. Is that true? Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. that's true. Yes, true. yes. But the Holy Ghost did say that he, the different qualities of him, and Apostle has never met your husband, correct? Never met him, right? Never met him, yeah. That's right. And the Holy Ghost said he was a kind person, and uh, showed, yeah. you know, the qualities about him. Yeah. My God. Yeah. And is there anything else you would like to to speak about? How do you how do you feel now? Because it was a very, very, very powerful prayer that was spoken over your life to break things, to release, to free. How do you feel right now? I feel like it was a balloon, and you blow a balloon, and everything just come. The balloon just small, you know, go down. Mm, like a release. Yeah. When a balloon, like when you're holding a balloon, and it fills up and it fills up, and it's about yeah. to burst, yeah. and then you let it go, and there's a release. Yeah. Yeah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Amen. But give God glory. But give God glory for that. I give God thanks for everything we touched in my life this morning. And in July, I'm asking you for forgiveness. Wait a month from Harvey. I return to work with you after for forgiveness and I move out of my life. Is that what you're saying, Mama? You're saying you want for, you're trying to get yes. unforgiveness out of your life. It was muffled. Is that what you were saying? Yes. Glory be to God. That's your release. Let her oh. speak. Let her. Let her speak. Hallelujah. Yes. Speak. 
speak. Let her speak. Let her speak. If, if she yes. want to do it right now in the presence of God, this is my yes. God birthing out what need to come out and for yes. her to, to gain my God in you. So let her speak. Yes, speak it. Everything was hard in my mind. Everything was hard before what it done to me. But I don't know if done them anything wrong. But I will speak the truth. If I see something, I will talk it out. And there will be a night with me. And I ask God to God will forgive me. But now what I am done to people and what people have done to me, I need to move on. And... I asked you to give me from July. I asked you to give me from July. Because I'm not going, I'm not coming. My life was just stagnant and I'm asking God for that. I just need that right now in my life. I just need a new life. And I, and I'm trying to understand you and hear you correctly. So you said you're asking God for a new life? Is that what you said? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes, I asked him for that. I asked him for that. Yes, I asked him for that. Because I had a lot of things on my stomach. I had, I had a, a lot of things. I had a confession this morning. I had a sister push, and it's just every piece, every thing should take over my life. It's just. Your feet, you're feeling, uh, you said something on your stomach. Is that what you just said? Hard to hear you because it's a bit muffled. I said, everything on my life. Okay. What was inside of me, I asked to forgive me. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. He's able, he's able. What you need to do is to just pray and ask the Lord God. And I said, Lord, change my life, oh Lord. Take away everything. That is not of you. Everything that is a blockage that causes me to behave, act, do anything that is not pleasing in the sight. Forgive your husband everything as you said. Just pray this prayer. You're gonna, you know, things is gonna be better. And as you continue to tap in on the YouTube channel, or if you're able to tap in online here, you will find a such a change in your life. You will never remain the same. Amen. Amen. Come on, people, Glory. lift up the Lord Jesus Christ. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you what you did, Father God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you for your healing. Thank you for your forgiveness. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your loving kindness. Oh, Lord God, that we can call upon you and you hear and answer the prayer to you, our Lord. Thank you, Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Worthy to be praised and adored. Hallelujah. Yeah. Magnify you, we honor you, Jesus. We give you all the glory that you deserve, Jesus. Be thou glorified, Jesus, high and lifted up. Mighty God, mighty God, you are high and lifted up. Hold your whole voice down. Thank you very much. Glory be to God. Is there anyone on the line from Jamaica? Um, I'm not from Jamaica. No, 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 no. In Jamaica. In Jamaica. That is calling in oh. Jamaica. Is there anyone that is calling from Jamaica? Oh. Marco said to the condo the bush in there. Oh. Mama Shende. Um, is there somebody, is there somebody that is troubling with cramps in their stomach? Cramps in their belly, whatever, whichever way. Cramp. Amen. That's, that's me. Amen. What's your name? Who's your name? Your name, please. My name is Yannick. Y-A-N-I-C-K. Wait, say that again. Y-A-N as a Nancy. I-C-K. I-T. What was the last letter? T. T. Y, y as in yellow. A-N-I-T. I C C as in tick. C C. Yannick. Yannick. Yes, of course. Yeah. And 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 what's the last four digits of your phone? Of my phone is. You know, the I'm last four. Google, I'm using Google Voice. Oh, okay. Google. Yeah. 
Okay. Do do um is there is there any number for her like the last digit? What she said about that? She's using Google Phone. So oh, so it's Rocco Satana Mama Kande. Marco said to the the bush in there. Marco said to the candle the bush in there. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. All right. Thank you very much. God bless you. God bless you. Yes, mighty God, mighty King Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. Who is the person praying? What's the name of the person that is praying? Hello. Not hello. Bless God. Hallelujah. Bless God. What's your name, mommy? My name is Tanya. All right, stay put, Tanya. You're next in line. Okay. The next in line. The next in line. Let me deal with um, Mama Nicole. No, this is Yannick. Mama Yannick. Mama Yannick. Yes, yes, yes. Mama Yannick. Yes, Lord. Marco said to the candle about Shende. So as I was saying, my God Almighty, as I see in the room, my God Almighty, I see where you're having cramping, right? Yes, that's correct, yes. Marco said to the candle about Shende, Rikataraba Kutori Bekende. And sometimes, my God Almighty, I even, different from the cramping, sometimes I see in the realm of your body as I, you know, as I look through the eyes of the doctor, my God Almighty, I also see tightness in your stomach as well. Come on, talk to me. Yes, 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 sir, yes. Sir. I also see my God Almighty, like, um, mm -mm. ask yes. for you all to worship God. You all just keep, I don't know, my God, I don't know all you all do. Still let you say you love Jesus. Still let you say you love him. Look at that. Right, say you love Jesus, but you can't worship him. That's sad. Jesus. Let me get back to my God Almighty, Mama Yannick. Marco said to the candle bush in there. Yes, my God Almighty, as I look through my God Almighty, the eyes of the healer, the balm of the true physician, my God Almighty, I can see my God Almighty, hallelujah, where my God Almighty, there's a, what you call it? There's a, a, a problem when you are to burp, is like, there's a burp. Say it, say it, teacher. Say it, my teacher. Like an indigestion. Right. Indigestion. Right, I see that also in the midst. Come on, talk to me. Yes, yes, yes. Marco said to the candle of Rikata Raba Kuturi Abasende, Robo Kuturi Abashandai, Mama Sheke, Roko Satara Ba Kuturi Yama, Mama, Mama, Mama. I see my God Almighty, Marco said to the candle. You're having my God Almighty also having knee problem. My God Almighty, the enemy don't want for God's people to walk. <laughs> Jesus. Marco said to the candle of Oshia, na 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 kundai. Robo Kotoria Baba Sende, Roko Seteri Katara Bakunda, Mama Shende, and it's not just one knee, it's knees, your knees, Mama Sende, Marco Seteri Kandara Bashandai, Mama Shende, I see tender foot bottom, your bottom of your feet is tender, your feet, my God, you have to wear certain shoes, you can't wear anything odd. Marco Setri Katoria Bakunda, Rabba Bakotoria Basende, as I look through my God Almighty, your body. Mama Masheke Rekotoria Basata, Robokonde. And what, I, what I'm saying right now is that if there's anyone else that is on this line that going through whatever, whatever, receive when God is calling out people of God because you can get your healing right away. 
That's right. Marco set the candle bush in there. Rabba Kotori and all your voice down, please, please, all your voice down as you, you know, receive and just say, I receive. You know, you don't shout, you don't have to shout, but just say, Quiet. I receive. Quiet. And just say it with authority, my God Almighty. Because if this is new birth people of God, the ninth month, the first, my God Almighty, 2017, know that, my God Almighty, God is birthing out, my God Almighty, miracle signs and wonder in the midst of your life to bring a change. Marco Setri Kandolbo Shende. Rabba Kotoria Bashanda, Mama Keke, Roko Sende. I'm telling you, people of God, things are, my God Almighty, coming to the better. My God Almighty. I don't know if you all can receive that. I receive that in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Marco Setri Kandolbo Shende, Mama Yannick, Marco Setri Kandolbo Shende. As I travel through the realm, as I in the realm of the spirit and looking at your body, my God Almighty, Roko Setri Kandolbo Shende. I see my God Almighty pain in your anus. Pain, pain. I see pain in your anus. Your pain, like even when in your wrist, when you move your hand, if you move your, the wrist of your hand, you can feel the pain. I'm not good to just my knees. Marco said, I said, if you move the wrist of your hand, my God Almighty, dear, I see the pain in your hand wrist. You, it might, you, it might not occur fully right now, but okay. you will see it. I'm telling you. I don't know you. I don't know. I don't know nothing about you. I'm just telling what I'm seeing. Marco said, I'm not trying to force anything on you neither. Marco set the candle about Shende. Rabba Kotoria Bashanda. But I know my God Almighty Hakola Besende. As you talk about your knee, yes, I know your knee is very bad. It needs to fix. You need to get your knee together. And the power of God can do it because when God see it, He will fix it. Marco set the candle about Shende. Rabba Kotoria Bashanda. Rabba Baba Baba. Roko set the Kata Rabbi Kendi Yandar Bashende. Roko set the Kata Mama Sanda. Right on your wrist, you know, um, um, I wanted to tell me, I want to tell you something where I'm tracking right now. I'm tracking on your behind, right to your behind, coming down to your leg. There, sometimes there can be, my God Almighty, uh, I, I don't know, I see something would run there like something would want to shock you there. <laughs> Right to your behind, coming down to your leg, on your right leg, right there. Sometimes something would shock you to your behind, right there, shock you. What well, if you understand what I'm talking about? Marco said to the candle about Shende. Robo Kotoria Basata, Rabba Kundu. Rabba Kotoria Basende. And I see my God Almighty in the realm. Something is going on with your, my God Almighty, your right ears. Even the left ears, but your right ears mostly. I see something going on with your ears, my God Almighty, where there can be, my God Almighty, a little, ah, uh, it's not, how could I put it? Who is talking? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that going on like that? Somebody with children too, I can hear. I hear somebody like somebody crying. Well, there's a, it sounds like a baby. I hear it. No, I didn't hear a baby. I hear like somebody said, Jesus. And you know... Whatever they're carrying on with. Those kind of things distract me. If I'm not speaking to the person, it distracts me. Yes. Marcos. In the background, please, please, please mute your phone. Jesus. Marcos said to the candidate Shende. Mama Mashanda, as I look, my God Almighty, in the realm of the spirit. You know what I was about to say? Just knock me out, oh my God. Rako set the candle to Shende. Bring it back, Holy Ghost. Marco set the candle to Shende. Mama Shandai. Jesus, talk, Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost, you are worthy, God. You are worthy, God. 
Hold on your voice, hold on your voice. Um, somebody trying to say something? The, mommy, Yannick, are you saying something? No, I'm just, I'm just praising, praising the Lord. Okay, blessed be the name of the Lord. Marco said to the candle of Shende. Yes, as I was saying with your ears, my God Almighty, I see something, my God Almighty, where the enemy want to mess with your earring, your earring. Okay. Okay. But, but what I see, my God Almighty, is like, my God Almighty, the, you know, uh, 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 something way down on the inside of your earring where the enemy want to... Bring that, you know, like you you will hear, but sometimes it is like not like not, not so good. Not so good. Mm, Jesus, mm -hmm. Marco, no. When when God talking to your mommy, don't answer like that. Said yes, it's true. Come on. Mm -hmm. Right. When God is talking, said yes, it's true. God is not a mm -hmm. God. He deserve more than that. That's right. He okay. deserved more than that, yeah. mommy. He deserved more than that. For God to have me to go to go in the room and can look in your body like this. God deserves more than that. Amen. Amen. Marco said to the candle of Boshende. Robo Kotoria Bashandai. Rabba Kotoria Baba Basheke. Mama Sheke Ye be 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 be. Roko Sata Mama Kunde. Sometimes you feel a little stick in where your heart is. I feel a little what? Stick, 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 like a little pain, sticky. Like a little prick in your heart. Like a prick in your heart. Okay, uh-huh. Yes, teacher. Marco said to the candle of Shende. Rabba, baba, baba, kotoria, basende, rikata, rabba, kotoria, kandei, bebe, be, se, robo, kotoria, bashandai, mighty God, everlasting Father, glory, glory, glory and honor to the Lord Jesus Christ, Marco, set, rikanda, mama, shandai, mama, sheke, I see also in the realm of the spirit, mommy, where you, you go to sleep, but you, you, you are troubled over, over matters, over stuff. You are troubled over things pertaining to my God Almighty family. You are troubled over things. I have problem with what? You're the, troubled over I family. didn't say problem. I said I see you're troubled over things. Troubled. That troubled. things things you want to, you know, like you thought a lot, you think a lot about things that you, you know. Yeah, I think, yes, I think a lot about things. Yeah, that's true. Marco said to the candle of Shende, Robo Kotoria Basanda, Mama Kunde, Roko Seteri Kandara Basanta. I see you as a non nonsense person, a non nonsense person. No nonsense. No nonsense person, a no nonsense person. Yes. And the question I want to ask you why didn't you why didn't you pursue for being a teacher like to be a principal hmm. i'm not in that field pardon me i said i'm not in that field i am not saying that oh my god she's not getting me no she said Mama. why didn't you pursue the question why was, why you, didn't you... I see you where you would do well in that part. The Well, you would do good. You would do good. Being a principal? Being a teacher, principal, what, you know, whatever. I see you would do well, well in that area. All right, okay. All right. Not course, You see, I want you all to listen to me very keenly because... I don't want people to say, oh, that's a false prophet. She's saying things that God is not saying. And say, mm -mm. No. Marco said to the candle of Shende. Robo Kotoria Basanda. Mama Kotoria Baseke. Mama Shanda. Do you have somebody in your prob in your family that have? Mm. I see a man. I don't know if you know this person. I don't know how well you know your family, but I see a man that have something wrong. Is he have a head problem? A head problem. Head problem? Yes, I see a man that have a head problem. So, like, I, I, you said a little off, a little off. Okay. 
the person is a little off. Okay, okay. Yes. Do you know of that? Someone who's a little bit off mentally? Minister Gay, tell her what I say. Yes, is it somebody in your family that's a little off? Yes, sure. Pardon me? Yes. Yes, it is true, she said. Yes, I see this person a little off. You know, Marco said to the candle, which said, But this person that I see that is a little off, my God, oh God Almighty. You know, people can be stopped. Can be stopped in their life. You know, just to rise where the sky is their limit and could have yeah. been, my God Almighty. I hear the word inspector. Inspector. I hear the word inspector. You know, the person. Okay. What question? In other words, the person could have been an inspector, the potential in their life. Yes, yes, yes. You're right, yeah. The person got yes, stopping you, yeah. Pardon me? The person got stopping you, destiny. I'm telling you, I see this person has been stopped in their destiny. That person has been stopped. I see this per Roko Sotoria Basanda. Because I see all, uh, I see three certificates, my God Almighty, and on to this person in the room. Three, sir. Ribi Asha! Mama Makotoria Basende. Wow. Wow. I see three certificate and on to this person in the realm. That means this this you see what you all need to understand, people of God. Let me let me teach you all something. Whatever you becomes in life and go forth and get it. You need to understand that these things has been given to you, my God Almighty, before you earn it spiritually. Mm. Marco wow. said to the candle Wow. What I, what has not been given to you, you will always find problem and you'll never be comfortable and happy in it and you can't able to pursue without witchcraft, without obia in the midst. But whatever has been given to you, my God Almighty, that's that's where you find my God Almighty, you will do real well in. Yes. And I see, my God Almighty, this young man, my God Almighty, this man. I see this man, because he's not that young, 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 but I see this man. Big man, I could say big man. When you, when you pass, you're 30, or oh, big man. Get what I'm saying? Yes. You're not no little boy, passing your 30s. <laughs> but I see, my God Almighty, this person, my God Almighty, has been undone with three certificates. Mm -hmm. Three certificate has been handed on to this person that this person have potential. This person could have been my God Almighty so much things in life. Mm -hmm. Marco said to the condo, I see inspector. I see my God Almighty, this person working in the government area. And what the person working in the government area, what I see, I see the person working in the government area, and I hear the word this this Distinction, distinction. Distinction. Okay. What is that? Expl explain that to me, Minister Gay. Meaning that a person stands out among the rest. You're distinct. My God Almighty. That's what I see with this person. Okay. My course said to the candle of Ocean Day. Oh, Holy Ghost, I feel your Holy Ghost. Marco Setrikanda Bashandai. And I see my God Almighty also, my God Almighty. This person. What I see with this person that has been stopped in the track. This person could have even been manager in in big fields like you know, government system. Three different things I see, you know. But this person has such a great potential. No, is that person, is that person in the same house with me or somewhere else? Mommy, listen to me. This is not a psychic thing or what have you. I'm just seeing in the realm of the spirit. When you're asking those questions, it's like I'm a psychic person and I must force to tell you. I only can go with what God is saying, Mommy. You must know if you have somebody in your family like that. You get what I'm saying? 
I try not to answer these questions because I don't want people to believe that I'm a psychic reader or Yababasha Mako Setirika Rabababa Kotoria Basitiria Kandaya Makende. Right. When the Holy Ghost stop in and see things, he just see things. And if you have somebody in your, my God Almighty, wherever that person is and you know of that person, you just know, my God Almighty, for sure, that the Holy Ghost is stopping in on somebody. I wonder if you all get what I'm saying. Yes, that's right. Amen. Amen. Everybody understand what I'm talking about? Yes, definitely. I don't speak what God don't tell me, no. I only speak what God show me and say through me. Mako setrikanda. Raba kotoria basende. Robo kondianda rabashandai. Mama kutu. There has been dung fault, my God Almighty, in the family. There has been dung fall. Dung fall in the family. And it's because of wickedness, wickedness, wickedness. I chase in the realm of the spirit. I don't know what's wrong with these these great grandfather people. I don't know what's wrong with them. They they just love to do wickedness and you know keep back people and have things, my God Almighty, to happen so that it can be a blockage even in the younger generational life. Uh, God Almighty. Marco said to the but also, my God Almighty, it is a fight going on with the family where the family must able to must not able to survive, must not able to pursue. My God Almighty, Cl close friends, close mm -mm -mm -mm. close friends. I see, I see, my God Almighty, soldier. I see soldier. I see soldier, I see close friends, my God Almighty, that being wicked, to, you know, to, 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 to commit wrong, to do wicked things. Don't want to see, my God Almighty, others rise. What a wickedness, Lord Jesus Christ. Marco Setrikando de Boshende. Robo Kotoria Babakunda. Robo Kotoria Basende. My God Almighty, Mashoko Yebe Keteria Mama Kuku. Jesus Christ of mercy. I come against death out of the family. I come against death out of family and relative. I don't know how wide you know your family or your, your, your relative, because your family is your immediate family, but relative and family, you know, but sometimes when I said family, I mean relative as well, but I need to bring it, you know, pre, um, you know, to speak of it definitely for you to know, specifically for you to know what I'm talking when I said family, when I said relative. Marco Setri Kandor Boshende Rako Sandara Baba Kutoria Bakende Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. I pray, my God Almighty, Jesus. that the Lord God Almighty will empower you as from today so that you will be that person that I see you as in the rim, a uh, consulter. I see you as a person that have that spirit in you. Amen. Amen. A consulter to give good. You, you can illustrate to people and give, give, give good instruction, good direction, good way in life. You have that anointing on your life. I see like a teacher, a teacher. That's what I see, a teacher spirit up on you. Marco Setrika, you don't receive that. I receive it. I receive it. I receive it. Now I hear you. Now I hear you. You see, some of some of you, the way some of you, the way you answer God is like God owe us everything, and when God giving us something that we don't want it with us, Amen. Thank you, Lord. Come on, we must get excited for God. Yeah, Mama Kotoria Bakendi and the Bosendi. 
Mama shekeri kataraba kunda. Mama shende kikaraba soto. Mama shende. Who's, my, I hear my God Almighty, woman of wisdom. My God Almighty. Amen. shende. But you see what happened in the midst of you with many people. They don't seem to get these things and understand these things where you is concerned. Many don't understand. One or two know it. Want to hear what I'm saying? Is she Where's the... the Lord? Where's the Lord? One or two know it, but some people, my God Almighty, they don't, they don't get it. They don't understand it. And you need to, my God Almighty, pursue it. What you need to do, you need to sit in the word of God as much as you can. Okay. If you don't able to sit in the word of God, put it on and let it, let it, let, and, and you know, at times you relax and listen to the word of God, especially the book of Proverbs. Mm -hmm. It can, it can bring up and plow up some things in you for the younger generation. Amen. Amen. I'm going to pray for you. I'm going to pray for you. Marco Setrikandai. Mama Shende Rikatarabakutu Riaba Sandai. Rabakotoria Basende. My conde baby setebo sa. You know, mommy, um you you know, as old as I wouldn't say the old because I'm not looking at you as a whole woman, you're a young woman, you know what I'm saying? But um, in the midst of you, you know, you can have people in the midst that in their thirties, name it whatever, and they, you know, they have a stubborn spirit, stubborn spirit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God is more than a hmm. -hmm. I don't like people answer hmm -hmm at all. It's a turn off to me. I don't like it. Amen, amen, amen. Where God is concerned, you know, answer him right. Him deserve oh God the best. Him deserve a yes God, yes God are I don't understand God, I don't understand. Simple. Marco set the candle bush and the oh great is our God, oh great is his name. You love to sing, mommy. You love to hum and sing. Yes, it is true. You love to hum and sing. When you do that, you invite angel in your me. Yabasha Marco set your katarabakunde. Glory. Rabakunde. That relax your mind. It um, it help you, my God Almighty, to even you know, go forward with what you are doing. Marco setri kanda boshende. Mama shandai. Masekere keke lo bosanda mama kundai. You you miss you miss you you miss family very much. I see you miss family very much. Those that die, you miss yes. very much, and it can bring a sadness on you at times. A sadness, my God Almighty. I see three people that my God Almighty pass, and these three people bring up. You know, it's just. If 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 God could just turn back the hands of time, it's you know which is kind of difficult right now because these things happen from when, but it has been really they have been really missed. You get what I'm saying to you? No, I don't understand that part. Marco set the candle to Shende. Rabba Kotoria Baba Sandai. Marco Sende. Mama Shandai. Let me pray, let me pray, let me pray. I'm not getting into that. I'm let me pray. Marco Sendiri Candle Boshende. Mama Shende Ke Koda Basanda. I'm asking for the angel of God Almighty to to touch your body and for this cramping to be cramped and paralyzed out of you and for the power of God Almighty to take you over completely, take over your mind. My course to the for the Lord God Almighty to bring 
newness, my God Almighty, in your life. Marco said to the candle machine, the Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, King of the universe, my God Almighty. Mm, what's your name again? Yannick. Yannick. My God Almighty, Kondal Bostende. Roko Seti Kandala Bashandai. Mama Shandai, Marco Seti. You know, it's strange to know that they find a very nice young name give you, you know, back then. Not that you're old, old, but at your age, you know, they find a very nice name give you, Yannick. Yes, yes. Cause you find mostly young people with that name. <laughs> am I am I am I saying something to you? It's true. Yes, yes. Marco said to the candle Boshende. Rabba Kotoria Basanda, Father in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Come right now, Holy Spirit of God, and fill your people temple right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Take over, my God Almighty, your daughter, right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Breathe upon her afresh. Move, Lord God Almighty, upon her body. My God Almighty, from the crown of her head to the sole of her feet, I command the angel of the living God, healing angel. I command, my God Almighty, hallelujah, warring angel. I command every angel in the midst, my God Almighty, to surround your daughter. I command, my God Almighty, hallelujah, speak long life, good health upon her body in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I ask you, Lord God Almighty, to take full control. Let not any may prevail, O God. But let the Spirit of God arise and the enemy, Lord God Almighty, of her soul scatter right now in the name of Jesus Christ, my God Almighty. As to Lord God Almighty, hallelujah, my God Almighty, that young man, my God Almighty, that you have put in the midst. My God, I pray for my God Almighty is mine. I pray that his mind will come together. Marco said to the candle, O Shindy. I come against Marco said to the candle, every force is of the darkness, every spirit. I command it to live. Receive, receive, receive! Marco said to the candle, Rabba Mama Keke, Rogo Tata Mama Kundai. In the name of Jesus Christ, let God arise and the enemy, my God Almighty, of my God Almighty, Hallelujah. Your daughter Yannick, my God Almighty, Mama Yannick. Let the enemy of her soul, her family, relative, my God Almighty, let the enemy of their soul scatter back to the pit of hell. I come against forces, darkness, in the midst, my God Almighty, from generation. In the mighty, precious name of Jesus Christ, stand up, O oh God, and let this family stand strong. Lord God Almighty. Bring down every plan of Satan, my God Almighty. Let there be healing, miracles, signs, and wonder upon the family. God Almighty, turn things around. Touch your daughter. Take out, my God Almighty, pay the cramp, everything. I cramp, I paralyze it. I shatter it. I scatter it. I command it to lift back to sender. Back to the wicked old dragon, Satan, right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, take over. Have your divine way, Lord Jesus Christ. Marco Santri Kanto the Boshende. Bring down Marco Satara Kandai. Rebe. Kotoria Bawakanda, Rocco Siana Nakata Tata Tata, Rebebe Ketoria Bakundiama, Robo Kondi and the Basheke Bikata Maku. In the name of Jesus Christ, let God arise and the enemy scatter right now. Do for your daughter more than what she can ever imagine or think. As she take the word up, my God Almighty, to read it. Let wisdom, knowledge, and understanding flow in the midst. Let it take her over, my God Almighty, so that she can, my God Almighty, empower the young people in the midst of her family and relative in the mighty name of Jesus Christ and other that she meet as well Father God of the divine way let not let him prevail as we give you the praise the glory and the honor for your everlasting Father you are worthy Lord God Almighty and you are great be glorified I am lifted up in the mighty powerful precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ glory be to God hallelujah as we give you Marco Setrikanda as we give you Mama my God Almighty, the leadership spirit that is in her, God Almighty, take it over and move upon it, O oh God, and lift her higher in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. As we give you praise, glory, and honor, let there be new birth in Jesus' name. Receive your new birth in Jesus' name. I'm 
Ghost Fire. Woo! Hello, can we do it? Fire! Thank you, Holy Ghost Fire! Oh, Jesus! Fire! Mighty God! Jesus, Lord. lift your faith up, people of God, and lift your faith up to the Lord Jesus Christ. Lift your faith up. Lift it up, lift it up, Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Holy God. Mighty God. You are worthy, Jesus. Hallelujah. You are worthy. Oh, hallelujah. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. to God, hallelujah. Mighty God, I love you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You were just Marco said to the candle Jesus. Go for it. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Mother Yannick, I'm going to speak with you now for a few moments. And what I would like Yes, what I would like to do is, and the areas that the Holy Ghost was ministering to you, touching okay. upon different things in your life, what I would like you to do is to just, you know, um, testify about what was spoken and how the Lord ministered to you in those particular areas. Stick with what the Holy Ghost showed and, you know, don't go into any other parts of of, of your business because we want to stick with what the Holy Ghost is doing here for you right now. So go forth in Jesus' name. Yeah, the first uh, reason I, uh, I said it was me because she mentioned that clapping, the abdominal clapping. Yes. I've been having, I've been having that abdominal clapping. I can't sleep. I've been praying, praying, praying. Oh my God, stop I don't want to give you pain too. It was so bad. It was very painful. Yes, yes. Oh, my God. And there was Jesus. Have your way, Lord. It's my knees. Yes, go ahead. And my knees has been a problem. And I need my knee to work. The type of work I do, I'm, I'm on my feet all day. I need my knee. My knee is going to be a and your, te and your feet, the bottom of your feet, right, have been tender, correct, as the Holy Ghost showed? Yes. God. Yes, ma'am. I have to bend my knees. Just to put me down. What I do, God is not going that happen. He's not going to let that happen. The Holy Ghost is on my side. Well, let me tell you something right now, this minute. As the as the was tapping into those areas, that's why the woman of God encourages you know, uh, to respond and, and, you know, to have that excitement because when the Holy Ghost finds it, it is fixed. Fixed then, in Jesus' name because the God uses her as a root digger. And so he's getting to the root here, the roots of your problem. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> the Holy Ghost was also saying, did you feel also maybe with this pain, you, there was a pinching, something pricking. The Holy Ghost was saying your heart sometimes trouble yeah, you. <laughs> Every now and then, on occasion, yes. Because the Holy Ghost showed that you had been troubled yeah. over things. Yes, yeah, I've been mean, I have, I have been mad. Oh, God. 
Who's talking? Somebody in the background. I'm having a real hard time. There's somebody's car dinging. I just am hearing different things. Go, go ahead. I'm sorry. You were saying oh, that, that. Yes, I've been thinking about it a lot. I have a lot of going on in my life right now. A lot. <laughs> But the Holy Ghost sees it and knows it. And you know, I'm going to say this to you, Mother Yannick, and this goes for everyone. When she says, and this might be a unique thing that you've experienced, when she said, I'm going through your body, I can tell you quickly something that happened to me. One day the woman of God was praying, and the Lord took her inside my body. I didn't know it was going to happen, just like with you, it just happened. And the Holy Ghost revealed to the woman of God, in my case, I'm just speaking for me, but I'm going to share this, that I was consuming coffee. I'd been a coffee drinker for over 30 years. And I'm not talking one cup a day. I'm talking somewhere up to eight cups a day. I loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. Would drink it, didn't eat, would do whatever. And the Holy Ghost showed her as she traveled through my body. This is what's so precious about this experience. Is the Holy Ghost showed her that I could have eventually developed cancer if I did not get off of this addictive substance. I'm just speaking for me, not saying it's you. But what I'm illustrating is that moment, and I wrote it down, it was January 14th of this year. And when Holy Ghost did it, I immediately got delivered. And I'm going to tell you, here I am on the 1st of September. I have never gone back and had a cup of coffee. I can be around it. I can smell it. I could be in a coffee shop. And if that was not the Holy Ghost, I wouldn't have been able to do it. But I just want to demonstrate to people what it means when the Lord uses her to go through your body. Because know that when he does it, it's fixed. Amen, amen. I want you to have that confidence to know he cares enough about the detail. If he could take her through my body, if he could take her through your body, what cannot the Lord do? Come on now. Nothing's impossible. Hey, so I just wanted to say that. The Holy Ghost was telling me to just say that for an encouragement to know because that experience blew my mind to actually have someone go inside my body. I didn't even know it was happening to me, but the Holy Ghost knew. And by the way, the Holy Ghost saw the future in that if I didn't stop what I was doing, destruction was coming my way. So I give God praise and glory. But anyway, back to you, my dear. So the Holy Ghost was showing there was somebody in, in your family that would have been, you know, very, very high distinction. Somebody perhaps in government, and she could see in the realm about certificates being handed down. Is there somebody in your family that, um, you know, is a little off, as she described, perhaps? Is that, you know? Yes, but that's what I was asking her, but she said she's not a psychic. I understand that. I said, I, yes, I was trying to understand. Yes, I have someone, but she's not me. Okay. Okay. That's okay. The Holy Ghost awesome. knows. And what the Holy Ghost was showing with that illustration, and, mm -hmm. and, and this is just, you know, me speaking, is that what it means when wickedness, she talked about wickedness, when it comes in and it robs people of destiny. And even in the same case where she was talking about you, for example, she sees mm -hmm. you as a teacher. She sees you as a woman of wisdom. Mm -hmm. So many things. It's that destiny, you know, yes. that sometimes the enemy will try to rob. But in your case, bless God, the instruction was sit down and read as much of the word as you can, especially Proverbs. Yes. Yes. And I love what he's, what the Holy Ghost said. You like to sing or hum? I will call you. Yes. 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 Who is that? Hum. And when that happens, this, this I find so beautiful. The Holy Ghost said through her that it invites angels in and relaxes you and helps you to go forward. Yes. Mighty God. Mighty God. Mighty God. So you keep humming and you keep yes. doing what the woman of God instructed. Why is Yannick always humming? I always have something. I'm humming. I don't even know that, but other people notice that. I said, why? Look at the Holy Ghost. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Keep, 
Bless God. Yes, yes, yes. Bless God, you keep humming. Yes. Keep humming, you know why? Because the Holy Ghost just said when you do that, angels, you invite angels. Bless the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. And may I ask you, my dear sister, was it was it that you were, um, how did you come on to service today? Did you see it on YouTube? Yes, I've been watching YouTube channels. I take YouTube. I love YouTube because that helps me a lot. That helps me a lot. I've been using cast on my TV, watching watching YouTube, and then I got into that channel, and then I decided this morning. Then this morning, when I woke up this morning, it was right because all night I've been holding the Lord, and then that number was stick on my on my TV. I think, yeah, I opened, I opened, I opened, I said, oh, today's Friday. Okay, what did I call now? Yes, yes, yes. You see that? You see that? Friday, the day that you tuned in, this is the 1st of September, the day of new birth. Look what God is doing for you. New birth in your life, mighty God, in all these areas of your life. Can we give God the praise and glory for what he just did, for what she just said and what she just testified about? Mighty God. Lord, her to this channel, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, hallelujah. And then brought her to, and compelled her to dial in. Look at that. After she was suffering and in pain all night. Jesus. Jesus. He always sends help. He sends help. He sends help. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, mighty God. Thank you, mighty God. Glory. Let's give him glory. Let's give him honor that he for what he did for me. Hallelujah. And we just, we just welcome you. We welcome you in the midst and we're so excited for what God did for you today. You can write it down the way I wrote down the January 14th, and that stays in my mind. Every time we get together, it's fabulous. But I wrote down that date. It was so significant to me. You'll write down this date and let it stay upon your heart and know what God did for you, the freedom, the healing, the miracle signs and wonders. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. How, um, fine, like, how is she doing now? Yes, how do you feel now? How are you feeling? I'm feeling a little better. I'm feeling a little better. You're feeling better? Is that what you said? It was muffled. No, yeah, that's what I said. I said I feel better. That's God. Hallelujah! How is this stomach? That's God. Give him praise. And you know what? How is your stomach? How is your stomach? How is your stomach? Yeah, how's your tummy? <laughs> so it's still there, but it's better. I come again, sit right now. Lift your faith up, mommy. Lift your robo kotoria bashandai. Whenever God move and call out your situation, you must always believe that it's already done. Lift your rebe kotoria bashendi. Right. I bind cramp and I paralyze that cramping right now. I command it to get out. I command it to get out in the name of Jesus Christ. I send it back to the pit of hell. I bring it down, Marcos and Ricanda. I command angel, my God Almighty, Ezekiah. Go in and Marcos and Ricanda the Moshende. I command Marcos and Ricanda, Mama Kutu. Roba Kondi and Darbeke In the name of Jesus Christ, healing. Receive it. Rabba Kotoria Bashende. Rebe Kotoria Basanda. Immediately, suddenly, and immediately healing right now in Jesus' name. Receive it. Receive it for your entire body. Receive it. Every part on your body, all pain, all cramp. Every part of you, and I pray the strength of the Lord Jesus Christ in your life right now in Jesus' name. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, Psalms 138. For everyone that is feeling weak in their body, Psalms 138. Yes. 
Yes. Verses, my God Almighty, two and three. I uh, listen to me as you go along and worship the Lord towards Thy holy temple and the praise of Thy name for Thy loving kindness and for Thy truth. For Thou hast magnified Thy word above all Thy name. Three, in the day when I cry, today, today when I cry, Thou answerest me and strengthened me with strength in my soul. Receive that. Receive it, people. Receive it. Receive it in Jesus' name. I receive it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I receive it. 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 I Glory be to God, hallelujah. Marco said to the candle of Shandai. Rabba Baba 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 Baba